Storm Team. Welcome back everybody to KX News at 10 on this Friday evening. We are taking a live look at Minot right now. Uh, seeing partly cloudy skies for the Magic City this evening. Temperature there in the upper 40s still and winds out of the north northwest around 7 miles per hour. So winds have died down throughout the night tonight. Bismarck right now looking at a few clouds in the sky. Temperature is 46 along with winds out of the north around 8 miles per hour. So once again, lighter winds this evening. Temperatures at the moment anywhere from the upper 30s still into the low 50s there. So it's still feeling fairly warm there in Mobridge. It's 50 degrees at the moment, 48 for Harvey. And right now in Watford City, it's 45. However, areas in the far southwest around Bowman starting to feel a little bit chilly. Temperature is 39. Winds mainly out of the east northeast anywhere from about 5 to maybe even 15 miles an hour still this evening evening. So winds are starting to really die down for western North Dakota and now they are finally starting to lighten up in the east as well. Now our satellite and radar is showing that we still have some light showers in southern North Dakota, mainly in the south southeast corner of the state. That's where we've had showers lingering throughout the day today, starting to disperse now as we roll into the later hours of the night and also off to the southwest around Bowman. Some light showers there around Hedinger as well. So precision cast here shows throughout the night tonight we will see some of those light sprinkles, but it's not going to accumulate to a whole lot by tomorrow morning waking up to mostly cloudy skies, so might not be best viewing for that 2023 solar eclipse. However, we are going to have mainly dry skies throughout the week and then rolling into Sunday morning, mainly sunny skies and increasing clouds throughout the night. By Monday, we are going to wake up to mostly cloudy skies out there, but once again, it's going to remain pretty dry. So once again, we do have that ring of fire rolling our way tomorrow. Peak day or peak time for us will be around 1130 in the morning and we do see that 64% of it. So what's showing on your screen right now is what will res resemble what we're looking at here in North Dakota. But remember, don't look directly at it. And if you do want to take a look at it, be sure to head to kxnet.com weather and check out meteorologist Stone Schaefer's weather wise. He can tell you some viewing tips for you guys. Highs tomorrow will be reaching into the uh, upper 50s for a lot of us and a uh, high around 52 for Garrison, some in the low, or upper 40s there in the northwest, high around 49 tomorrow in Stanley and 51 for Linton. And Dickinson's five day planner does show those temperatures really warming up for us by Monday and Tuesday, nearing those 70 degrees by uh, Monday and Tuesday for a lot of us. And then we do see rain chances returning by Tuesday and Wednesday, mainly in the evening hours. And after uh, Tuesday, we do see those temperatures starting to drop back down into the upper 50s. So we do have a nice warm up rolling our way, so we better enjoy it while we still can. Kiara.